Huge duplication glitches, brand new hotfixes, and even an update next week. Let's talk about it. Now, yesterday we had the biggest duplication glitch in LEGO Fortnite history come out. It was as simple as dropping all of your inventory, jumping into a teleporter, coming back to that inventory on the ground, and every single item was duplicated. Now, this glitch was patched after about six hours of being out, and anybody that tried to do this glitch after that six hour mark actually ended up losing their materials, which is extremely unfortunate. I did my best to make sure that everybody was aware that this was patched by changing the titles and mentioning that it was patched in there, changing the pinned comment, posting a tweet about it, and then also a Discord notification, as well as a YouTube community post. I understand that didn't get to everybody, so it's very unfortunate that people did lose some of their items. Now, this duplication glitch was only possible because Epic actually released a hotfix that allowed us to break all of the bus stations in the game. I already covered that and I don't want to talk too much more about it. We also had the hotfix that went ahead and fixed all of the unbreakable items in your Star Wars village or any of the villages on your map. Now a huge announcement that we got from Fortnite status is that servers are actually going down at 11 p.m. on August 15th, which is a day earlier than what they normally would. Downtime typically starts at about 4 a.m. on the day of the update. We're now getting it the night before, which means that this should be an extreme extremely large update for Fortnite, which would also mean that it's a very large update for LEGO Fortnite. Now, I'm still keeping my hopes up high when it comes to Clombo releasing into LEGO Fortnite, especially considering the fact that this update is supposed to be so large. Clombo was supposed to come anywhere from July and August and ending in the middle of August before the September update. The only problem right now is that it seems as though they have been delaying this Clombo update according to the roadmap. It's entirely possible that they did this so they don't continue to run into issues and I think the entire community as a whole can agree that they would much rather have these bug fixed than getting brand new content into the game that doesn't work. Now keep in mind the butter cake that is inside of the game is still a direct correlation over to Clombo as that was his code name when he was originally leaked in the original files. When it comes to butter cake they also updated these as well to make sure that you actually have a boost in your stamina when it comes to eating them which now officially separates them from bread. Now let's talk about that Clombo update as well because when it comes to the leaked files that we have on this, one of the leakers went ahead and mentioned that Clombo has three abilities, a charge feature, a launch feature, and a Clombo vacuum feature. The way that this worked inside of Battle Royale is that Clombo could charge at you and break objects, could also launch you from their snout or from their blowhole, and then also could vacuum in some food, which may be the reason why we have Clombo cakes. Now I don't expect you guys to know what this image is because I don't understand either. However, the leaker did mention that the butter cake that got added into the game is the main material function that will be used for the Clombo model, literally saying its name in the game. So it is very likely that we are going to need to use the butter cake when it comes to using Clombo. Now, Clombo is both going to have an aggressive style and then also a passive style. The way that the aggressive style works is that if you shoot at them, hit them with any items or anything like that, they're going to act just like a brute does, charging at you and breaking anything in its path. The passive style is obviously the more friendly style, which is going to allow you to drop food for them, for them to use that vacuum feature and very likely gift you stuff in return. Clombo is a very friendly creature, obviously, until you try to attack them. Now, I don't wanna bore you guys by showing you exactly what you need to do because I have talked about it a few times, but if you don't already have a gigantic farm that gives you an unlimited amount of butter cake, make sure that you guys get to work on that now. Two chickens, two cows, a wheat farm, and a slapberry farm will give you an infinite amount of butter cake extremely, extremely quick. Now let's talk about a few more things that could be releasing in this update next Friday. Again, it should be a very large one, so we should be expecting a decent amount in LEGO Fortnite, whether that's with content or more importantly, even bug fixes. And if you guys did not know, obviously I cover all of this stuff on my channel the second that it releases, but the LEGO Fortnite Twitter account is another great place to find any type of teasers or leaks that they try to put out there. Today they posted this picture here with the cow and uh, it doesn't tell us anything about the future update so don't look too deep into that. Now I'm not sure if this was done intentionally but ever since the most recent update any of the trees that are on the shore biome just give you no wood at all 
And again, I think this could be intentional. However, it doesn't make any sense that when you break these, they still give you the wood shattering noise, but then there's nothing that actually falls from these trees. Now, there's a lot of reports that are coming out about vehicles being glitched as well. They released new vehicles in the prefabs, but even the vehicles that you had previously seem to still be bugged and glitched out. Right now, one of mine is just kind of teleporting in the air. I don't really know what that piece even is, but it's up there. Now, this isn't my footage right here, but I have had multiple reports and have tried working Working with epic to fix an issue where a lot of people are losing a ton of loot that they had in their villages people seem to have walked up to some chests that they had and they have lost everything so i think it's safe to say that people are truly struggling with the way that the game is going right now and epic has a ton of glitches and bugs on their hands now on top of glitches and bugs they also removed the blue pig for some reason and again kind of like when it came to removing wood from the palm trees i'm not entirely sure why they just decided to remove the purple pig now it doesn't show up in your codex anyway but i did want to check and see if maybe it was located in here but yeah the purple pig or the blue pig has just been totally removed from lego fortnite now when it comes to more glitches and bugs that should be patched by the next update or next friday's update we should be taking a look at the bus stations this is the biggest part of this recent update and i assume that they are going to address this going forward right now the bus station is still bugged out as far as it's removing items from people if you drop them before it when trying to replicate the duplicate glitch but more importantly than that occasionally when trying to use this you're going to freeze your entire game and have to restart it's just going to drop you randomly from where you were trying to teleport to and that's not always the greatest of things because sometimes you spawn in and you're standing right next to a blast shell or you guys are spawned right next to a mob of enemies on top of that it's also occasionally causing you to load in and there be nothing rendered around you so maybe you try to teleport somewhere very far away and when you get there it's doesn't seem to actually render in your world that quickly and then you're simply falling down into water and have to restart your game again being a massive part of lego fortnite i assume that this is going to be something that they fix now they're also going to be working on allowing us to find these bus stations just a little bit easier while recording this video i was able to find two of them by running around with a flying vehicle however it is extremely tedious and difficult to do and some people are reporting that they are searching their entire world and truly not being able to find them it's very hard to find these out in the wild and there's also the glitch where you could break them while waiting for the bus driver and still be able to fast travel this isn't one that i really want to get fixed because i like that i could take everything from it and then fast travel out of there but when it comes to this obviously all glitches and bugs should be patched so comment down below what means more to you would you guys rather have bug fixes and glitches fixed in the next update or do you want to see clombo i feel like there's a possibility that we truly do only get one or the other i'm thinking maybe they delay the clombo update again to work on quality control and make sure that every bug and every glitch that's in the game is going to be fixed or they can go the route that i believe that they will and try to drop the content as well as trying to address a bunch of the bugs i am talking directly with epic to make sure that they do fix a lot of this stuff in the game so comment down below little things that you guys are experiencing that you guys would love to see fixed i hope that you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to like the video comment and subscribe and as always guys this was crafty and i'm out peace youtube thinks that you're going to like either one of these videos above so click on one of them and let me know what you think down in the comment section below oh and don't don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you aren't already